Action. We are gonna take it back to what happened on the last episode of WWA Action. Sure just yeah. as we were about to close out the night, Jim Duncan came out here and was attacked by his arch nemesis, Adam Soul. Adam used a steel chair and plant Duncan face first into it. Then another DDT right on the canvas. And these two have reached a hatred for each other that knows no bounds. They have to spend most of the year feuding. And uh, here in the World Wrestling Association, we believe it's time to put an end to this rivalry. And we are looking to do so inside an extreme steel cage. You have to see it 15 feet tall. It is an immense steel cage. Jim Duncan, Adam Soul, locked inside of it at Madison. Square Garden! <laughs> Meanwhile, we are live in Pensacola, Florida tonight. And we have one huge match for you tonight. The following contest is an elimination match. Making her way to the ring from Orlando, Florida, Michelle Martinez. This is a number one contenders match. The winner of this match will go on to face the women's champion for the title at the upcoming showdown at Madison Square Garden. Certainly going to be a very interesting night for one of these ladies, Michelle Martinez, a former women's champion in her own right, looking to get back in position. Challenge the women's champion for that title at Madison Square Garden. And from Washington, D.C., Charlotte Quinn. Charlotte Quinn is another former women's champion stepping into this match. Which oddly enough has not been in the title picture for quite some time. So like when you have people like Michelle who are trying to jockey back into position. Ashley who's looking for redemption. And Charlotte who's looking to climb back up the mountain. And then Charlotte Queen has won that championship on multiple occasions. Of course, 2019 may have not been a banner year for her. Maybe this match can help Quinn once again get to the top of the women's division. We know the style of Charlotte Quinn. Lay back. Hell bent on bringing about destruction into the women's division. Maybe she can bring some of that destruction here tonight to earn a championship opportunity. And, and, and you know, this isn't any championship opportunity. This is the final championship opportunity of the year and the decade. It's also our one show at Madison Square Garden. Sounds exciting. And 
from Birmingham, England, Emily Wells. So Emily Wells is the wild card in this match, and I explain to you why. Everybody in this match is a former women's champion except her. So like when you throw the question who wants it more, you could say Emily wants it more. Emily would love to not only get a victory here tonight, but to get a championship opportunity at Madison Square Garden. But she's had opportunities at the Women's Championship before. She's never won that championship before. So maybe that fire and that desire is what the other three are missing compared to Emily Wells. And there you see it on your screen. This is a number one contenders match. There's the bell. Here we go. Close line. And now remember, this is an elimination fail four way match. If we see a pinfall, that means that competitor is out of the match. But the match continues. Look at this. We already have submission maneuver. Michelle Martinez flying the submission maneuver to Charlotte Quinn. And Quinn with the reversal. Quinn getting the kick to the back of Martinez. Meanwhile, right here next to our announce table, Emily Wells putting on the pain. To Ashley. Back in the ring though, Jawbreaker by Martinez reversing on Charlotte. And Charlotte fights back, going for a crossbody. Martinez moves out of the way. Martinez sending. Quinn into the corner. Quinn moves out of the way. Martinez bounces out. Martinez back in the corner. And once again, Quinn moves out of the way. Or I should say Martinez moves out of the way. Martinez now. Fireman's carry. Planting. Charlotte Quinn back into the canvas. Meanwhile, on the outside of the ring, Ashley all over Emily Wells. Carrying her. Dropping her right on the outside of the ring. Shot there by Martinez back in the ring, but Charlotte Quinn bounces. Nice forearm to the face by Charlotte Quinn. That could mean an elimination here. Hook to the leg. Is it an elimination in this fatal four way match? And a kick out. We're seeing this um, very interesting strategy. We have two competitors in the ring, two competitors on the outside, and, and the competitors on the outside may be waiting. Here's the cover, hook of the leg for an elimination. And there you see Emily Wells trying to get back into the ring with Ashley with a leg drop. Now we have all competitors back in the ring. Oh no, Ashley, very smart, rolls out of the ring. And now we got three competitors in the ring. Charlotte Quinn going after Michelle Martinez and also going after Emily Wells. Emily Wells with the reversal. Spinning heel kick by Wells. Shoulders down. Who got a leg? And a kick out by Quinn. We have seemed to have switched opponents here. Ashley and Martinez going at it. Emily Wells and Charlotte Quinn as well. And now here's Wells. With her signature suplexes. That's two. And if you're counting at home, the three amigos are here. Three. And she bridges for a cover. Shoulders on the mat. Is it enough for an elimination? Yes, indeed. What an upset. Emily Wells has eliminated Charlotte Quinn. I guess we're not going to see any redemption from Queen. As she has been the first one to be eliminated from this match. This is now down to a triple threat match between Ashley, Michelle Martinez, and Emily Wells. It's a big forearm shot there by Michelle Martinez. Ashley on the ropes. Ashley gets dropped on the top rope by Martinez. Who goes for the cover here. Hook of the leg. Is it enough to put her away? Could it be? And a kick out. Oh, look at this. Over the third rope. Bad intentions from Emily Wells here. 
hooking in this submission maneuver on the ropes. And remember, this is all legal. And Ashley, of course, uh, helping Emily Wells there by punching Michelle Martinez in the face. A big kick to the face, and now everybody on the outside of the ring. Bad intentions from Ashley off the top with a missile drop kick. I don't think Ashley landed well there. It seems like Michelle just realized this is a no disqualification affair. Shot there. Oh, and a headbutt by Wells. This reverse on there by Ashley. And back and forth we go. Martinez has a steel chair and she's using it. But Ashley puts a stop to it. Martinez now on the outside of the ring. They need to reconfigure herself here. She gets dropped out right here in front of us by Ashley. This is all for the biggest opportunity of the year in the women's division. That's a nice reversal there by Martinez, but Wells finds her way in. Four on there. Back in the ring we go. Nice reversal here. And meanwhile, Martinez is back in this match, hooking Ashley in, tossing her across the ring. Ashley being sent to the ropes. Elbow to the face, and there's Emily Wells with a huge spear! That spear could eliminate Martinez here in a kick out! What a performance by Emily Wells here! That spear was incredible! And over the third rope goes Wells! Top rope goes Martinez! Bad intentions! Oh my goodness, she got the knees up! Martinez with a beautiful moonsault to the outside, but Wells got the knees up! Wells seems to be one step ahead of everybody in this match. Meanwhile, as nice reversal here by Martinez. Exploder suplex, but there's Ashley. Forearm to the face. And to the ropes. Elbow to the face of Ashley. And now a body slam right on top of the chair. What is Martinez doing here? Martinez could have capitalized. She had Ashley knocked out. She had Emily knocked out. But she's right here in front of our announce table undoing the table and just some darn bad intentions by Martinez. Martinez with very bad intentions headed to the top rope. Moonsault through our table! And I agree with our fans here in Florida, this is awesome! A beautiful moonsault putting Wells through the table. I don't even know how Wells is moving. Meanwhile, the cover on Ashley inside the ring, hook and leg. Not a revelation yet. How the hell is Emily Wells still moving? And on her way back to this match, we don't know. But here's Martinez with an egg breaker. The reversal there by Martinez. Oh man, down goes Ashley. Side rush of leg sweep and that's an STO off the STO. Michelle is looking to capitalize here with another STO. And here's Emily Wells fighting back with a drop toe hold, sending Martinez right into that chair. And now bad intentions. There is a suplex with the bridge that should do it. And Martinez gets the shoulder up. 
Cross body, Emily Wells does not rest. She's the sole woman standing right now. Both Ashley and Martinez are down. And Ashley blocking whatever um, Wells had in mind. And turn it into a submission maneuver. Submission maneuver locked in. Is she gonna tap? We may see Emily Wells step out here. Look at that, that kick. Opens the window for Wells to continue in this match. What a show with a share though. Ashley with the reversal. Martinez with the reversal back and forth we go. Martinez takes her down for the cover. Shoulders on the mat. Is it enough to eliminate Ashley? Ashley gets the shoulder up. Body slam. Shot to the back there. Sidestep. Shoulders down. Shoulders down. Is it enough to put her away? Could it be? Got her. Got her. Got her. Emily Wells has been eliminated. And Martinez turns her attention. To Ashley on the outside of the ring. Ashley seems to know what's coming. So she's not getting up. Martinez is going to look for her on the outside of the ring. Carrying her. Double of her shoulders. Plants her back down. On the cold hard ground. Here in the arena. And look at this. We know what this is. Exclamation point. On the roll of our table. Back in the ring she goes. Oh no! And Ashley moves out of the way. There is still hope. There is still hope for Ashley. As she carries Martinez on top of her shoulders. But Martinez with the reversal. But look at that. Very nice. That's that, that, that ring awareness by the veteran Ashley rolling out of the ring. But he may have also been a bad idea looking for the chair. And now Ashley dump throat first into that top rope. Off the second rope, Martinez, bad intentions dropping the knee to the head of Ashley. And Martinez taunting Ashley now. Martinez, bad intentions. Spear! Huttering half with a spear. That could do it right there. Shoulders down. Hook of the leg to get the victory and a kick out. She was going to use that chair, but she refused. Wait a minute. Yes, she's going to use that chair. DDT on top of the chair. And Martinez is not done. She knows what she wants to do next. Exclamation point. Shoulders down, hook on the leg, isn't enough. Michelle Martinez is headed to the garden. Here is your winner, Michelle Martinez. What a way to close out the year for this young lady. Michelle Martinez will now face Grace Perkins for the WWA Women's Championship at Madison Square Garden at the end of the year. What an incredible moment for that young lady right there as we take a look at the official graphic. First of all, we would like to send a special thank you to Max and Joy Badass for Steel New York. The official theme song for the showdown is available right now to stream on Spotify and Apple Music. Hell of a song for our big show in New York City, the final show of the year, the final show of the decade, which will now feature the WWA Women's Championship on the line. Challenge Jeremy Show Martinez, champion Grace Berkey. This has been a standard, incredible year 
for Grace Perkins, the rookie became women's champion and she's been tearing through the women's division. Will she be able to stop Michelle Martinez and her fire and the sire will find out live at Madison Square Garden. We'll find about this one on the last episode of action. Shane is willing to put his career online. I don't think that is a good idea. It's Shane versus John Rich. If Shane loses, he would have to retire. Who's going to walk out victorious? We'll find out live at Madison Square Garden. And for the national championship, Kevin Davies will go one-on-one -on -one against Sean Coleman. Sean Coleman is hungry. He wants it. In his hometown of New York City, will Sean Coleman be able to dethrone the man who has been a thorn on his side ever since they came up through a wrestling association? The national champion, Kevin Davies. And also for the Upstart Championship, Derek Avalanche may face his biggest challenge yet when he goes one-on-one -on -one against Kenta. Kenta has already promised to put Derek Avalanche to sleep, but Derek Avalanche is one plucky fighter. He's all hard. He's one of the best prospects in the World Wrestling Association today. Will he be able to defeat Kenta for the title? We'll find out live at the Garden. This is a rematch for the Tag Team Championship. The Disciples of Darkness have asked for their mandatory rematch against the new champions, the Defenders. Will they prove that the Defenders winning the title was just luck? We'll find out live inside Madison Square Garden. And a big one for the WWA Championship. It will be Austin Parker, the champion, putting his title on the line against the winner of the Gold Rush Tournament, Michael Carter. Michael Carter has had a roller coaster year. He started it off as champion. Will he be able to close the year as WWA Champion? Or will the reign of Austin Parker continue? And the main event, the Extreme Steel Cage Match. It will be Jim Duncan versus Adam Soul, the biggest rivalry we've had this year. We'll finally come to a close inside the Extreme Steel Cage. Join us, ladies and gentlemen, for our final show of the year, the Showdown at the Garden.